Hey guys, what is up? It is Drew here. Welcome back to my channel. It is finally getting cold in Los Angeles, which I am so freaking excited about. And today I'm gonna be doing some winter looks for you guys. Just sharing with you basically how I layer some of my looks for the winter time. And I'm gonna be sharing with you full outfit ideas and all that sort of stuff, kind of like videos I have done in the past, of course. But this video is a little bit more special because it is actually sponsored by the Portal Plus from Facebook, which is super, super exciting. I've had this like device at my apartment for probably about a month now, and it has been such a game changer I've been loving using it and just like having it around there are so many cool features that I'm gonna share with you guys throughout the video the portal and portal plus are a family of video calling devices that allow you to just interact with your friends and family around the world so let's just say one day for example like in this video you want to check in and see like what outfit someone likes more like you're gonna try on a couple outfits you can call your friends you can call your family and be like which outfit do you like more and the coolest thing that I think about this is the portal smart camera that actually stays with the action and automatically pans and zooms to everyone to keep them all in view and then it also has this really cool smart sound feature which basically means that when anyone is talking it enhances their voice so let's just say that they're all the way across the room but they're still talking it still enhances their voice as opposed to maybe some other like side chatter or whatever it might be and one of my favorite features that the Facebook portal offers is the built-in Alexa. We all, oh, I just said it. Oh, it's listening to me. So I guess I'm not allowed to say that word out loud or else she's gonna start talking to me. So you guys know who I'm talking about. It features her and you can talk to her and you can ask her to do things. You can ask her to play music. You can ask her to open up different applications that you can download on there. There's a ton of different feature. Ask her the weather, whatever you wanna do on there. I love that that is built in to the actual Facebook portal. And it also has some other really cool features including like a smart photo frame. So when you're not using it, you can display different photos on there to make it look like a nice little piece of artwork. But at the same time, it's very digital and useful. And there's also, of course, the music streaming you can go on Spotify or Pandora to listen to your favorite songs which is exactly what I'm going to be doing today while I'm trying on my outfits and sharing them with you guys and you can shop the portal from Facebook via the links in my description box below again they have the portal portal plus and portal TV so there's a couple different options to choose from or if you just want more information definitely take a look below but we need to get into these outfits because I am super excited to share with you guys some of the looks that I'm going to be wearing in the winter time. Winter outfits are honestly my favorite type of looks to wear because I feel like you can get the most creative with them in terms of layering. There's just a lot more to do when the weather is colder, but let's just go ahead and get into these outfit ideas. Hey Alexa, play pop music. Here's a station you might like, Top Pop on Amazon Music. Lately, I have not been one to wear full black outfits. I've been loving colors so much, but for some reason this winter season, I have been loving the idea of just really, really dark monochromatic looks. So this is a full black outfit featuring a really fun blazer, a pair of jogging trousers, which I think kind of sports up the outfit a little bit more. And I also added on this like waffle knit t-shirt and then finished it off with a pair of Converse sneakers, which is just very classic and timeless. Okay, so Danielle Cohn could literally never with this outfit. Um, I just thought this was really, really cute when I saw it in the store. I love the way that this looks. It's like a shearling oversized, like burgundy striped varsity sweatshirt. That was a mouthful. And I'm also wearing it with a pair of just black denim and a pair of Doc Martens, which just have a, like a platform to them. And I think this look is very like university school, but at the same time, like every day. Alexa. How hard is it to get into Harvard? Here's something I found on reference.com. Only 5.9% of applicants were accepted into Harvard in 2014. So I don't have a chance, mama. <laughs> kind of throwing in another monochromatic look here, but I did have an actual navy trouser in this one, and I just really love this outfit. I started off with a simple black sweatshirt and threw over it my Alix bomber jacket that I've been wearing literally every single day. I'm obsessed with it. And since these pants and like the silhouette was a little bit more formal, I felt, I wanted to just add a sneaker to kind of sportify the outfit. And that's exactly what I did with these technos. Light creamy tones like this have literally been a statement for me lately. And I'm saying statement because when you wear them as a full set, it really is like a statement. And I'm absolutely obsessed with this look. So I threw on a black hoodie and then I also paired it with kind of like a coordinating blazer and jean set, which the jeans are from Koss and then the blazer is just thrifted. And I finished it off with a warm suede boot and those are the Wyatt harness boots. Mm. 
Now here comes the real statement. I love this sweater. I think a bright, bold, thin sweater like this is a great layering piece for the winter time. And I just layered it with a very basic look, which is just consisting of black dad jeans, a pair of classic black Chelsea boots and a black moto jacket. And I also threw on a necklace just to kind of edge it up a little bit because I thought it felt a little bit dad-esque with the silhouettes. But in the end, I ended up loving the way this outfit turned out. I'm gonna call my roommate really quickly because I actually wanna ask her which jacket she thinks looks best with this outfit. Okay, so I have my jackets right here. Let's call her. Here she is. Okay, you guys also, look how cool. I hope that you can see this on the screen. Hey, hey Marie! So I don't know if you guys can, first of all, this is like only my second time calling Marie on here, but it really likes to just follow what I'm doing. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. I know, and then, these are the two jackets I wanted to ask you about. There's this good green one here, or this good yellow one here. They're the same jacket, and I'm wearing like a black outfit base. I know a bit of a, yeah, the, I, I kind of like the green too. The yellow's fun. It looks like this, everyone, if you can't see it. Here's the green one, um, but I think I like the green one a little bit more because it's a little bit more subtle. You know the vibes, you know the vibes. Yeah, you know the vibes. Okay, I'm gonna put this one on, so let's see how this looks. So we ended up opting for the sage green jacket, which I personally really love. I think the silhouette of this jacket is really nice. It's very boxy and kind of like an over shirt, but more on the cropped side. And then I kept, again, the base of this look, which is very simple. Um, it has a black sort of oversized jean with some clasping at the bottom, a t-shirt. I threw on some necklaces and again, back with those techno sneakers just to kind of add that sporty element. If you guys have been following me for a long time, you know that this jacket is literally my tried and true winter jacket. I absolutely love it. I think that the sleeves on it are so fun. They have these like toggle clasp details and they're folded up on each other. I just think they're really great. So I paired them with a cargo pant that kind of adds a sporty, but streetwear vibe to this. And then just a pair of black boots to kind of contrast all the way back up to the jacket. And this look is simple, but I think it's really stylish. Number eight is one that is a little bit more on the daring side for me. I just personally don't like myself in turtlenecks. I don't know what it is about a turtleneck, but something about it just always throws off a look. But I really like the way that this one paired with the moto jacket and the denim. I think it's a very classic and timeless look, but it's kind of like altered to be modern at the same time. And I threw on a pair of docks that just have a platform just to elevate the appearance of my figure, if you will. This green kith set is the newest addition to my wardrobe and I am just obsessed with it. I really want to get into more track suits, a little bit more cozier kind of athleisure wear because I think it can really pair nicely in the winter time and you can make it very trendy. So I actually threw a plaid trench coat over this I got years ago um, and paired it with a simple pair of white sneakers because I feel like the track suit is just like a statement on its own. <laughs> I'm sure a ton of you guys know Galax. He designed this suit. It is an iconic suit. I am obsessed with this outfit. It's probably one of my favorites, which is why I saved it for last. It is a contrast stitch blazer and a contrast stitch pant. I paired that with a gray t-shirt, a really cool sporty metallic kind of statement sneaker and threw on a black bag just to kind of like tone down the vibe of the blazer set because it is a little bit formal and that finishes off the look. Those were some of the looks that I have been wearing recently and going to continue wearing through the cold weather in Los Angeles. And by cold, I mean literally like maybe 51 degrees if I'm lucky. And last but not least, I want to thank Portal Plus by Facebook for sponsoring today's video. I think this is such a cool device and I'm definitely going to be using it through my everyday life, asking you know who questions. I'm going to be listening to music on it. I'm going to be calling my friends. There's a ton of different features on this device, which I think are super useful and definitely handy in your everyday life. I think I might even move this over to my kitchen area because I can actually go on and like look at recipes if I'm ever deciding that I want to cook something. Or if I'm doing the dishes, I can just play some music. I can call a friend, like whatever I want to do. I think I'm going to end up putting this like in my kitchen area, but you can really put it anywhere that you feel most suits your space. And once again, you could shop the portal via the links in my description box below. There's all the different types if you want to check them all out um, and see which one maybe most fits your guys' wants and needs. A perfect holiday gift. This is a great idea to get like maybe a grandparent or something so you can interact with them a ton. Um, I think this is a very simple device for people like that are maybe a little bit older and not as technologically 
advanced if you know what I'm talking about like this is very very simple there's only a couple different actions you can really do on it and it's not something too complex at all so it's a great holiday gift for one of your friends or maybe one of your loved ones if you just want to stay in touch a little bit more definitely subscribe to my channel if you have not already and click that little bell icon next to it but I'm not gonna keep you guys for much longer thank you so much for watching today's video I hope that you enjoyed it gave you a little bit of outfit inspo and I will catch you all in my next one bye guys